Hi students, now we are going to discuss parametric form of conics. So already conics pati nariya discuss paneer krom, the types of conics and then under that uh, so many concepts we have discussed. Now we are going to discuss the parametric form of conics. Let us see about parametric equations. So parametric equations abdi na inan paakla. Suppose f of t and g of t are functions of t f of t and g of t both are functions in terms of t then the equations x equal to f of t and y equal to g of t together describe a curve in the plane so the equations x equal to f of t and y equal to g of t so rendu separate kadayadu together both represents as, uh, represents the same curve in the plane so in general here t is the arbitrary value called in this case a parameter so in this case here, here t is called parameter so in some types of conics instead of t theta parameter nama use panikla. so here we have taken t as parameter and this method of specifying a curve is known as parametric equation so in the method la in terms of t x equal to f of t and y equal to g of t so in the madhi represent pandratha in this method uh, is specifying a curve is known as parametric equations okay. now let us see the parametric forms of different conics so first let us see about circle so the parametric equation of the circle is x equal to a cos theta and y equal to a sin theta so here we have considered theta as the parameter now the range of theta lies between 0 to 2 pi closed interval including 0 and 2 pi so now any point on the circle is of the form a cos theta comma a sin theta so on the circle mela layagra in the point it is in the form a cos theta comma a sin theta in a parametric formula x in the other other on the x coordinate of that point and what we have taken the y value a sin theta represents the y coordinate of that point so this is the parametric equation of the circle here we have used the parameter theta and this is the range of theta and any point if we take any point on the circle then it should be in the form a cos theta and a sin theta next parabola the parametric equation is x equal to a t square y equal to 2 a t so here we have considered t as the parameter now the parameter t value lies between minus infinity to plus infinity so the any point on parabola is of the form a t square comma 2 a t it abdi in the x y values abdi point a represent paniro x and y coordinates are so the parabola vada parametric equation is a t is x equal to a t square y equal to 2 a t next for ellipse the parametric equation of the ellipse is x equal to a cos theta y equal to b sin theta here the parameter is theta and the range of theta theta lies between 0 to 2 pi closed interval 0 to 2 pi now any point on the ellipse is of the form a cos theta comma b sin theta so x coordinate of that point is a cos theta and y coordinate of the point is b sin theta likewise for hyperbola x equal to a secant theta and y equal to b tan theta so here also the parameter is theta and theta lies between for hyperbola the range of theta is lies between minus pi to plus pi except theta equal to plus or minus 90 okay now any point on the hyperbola is of the form a secant theta comma b tan theta so in a except theta equal to 90 din putter kangana tan 90 varum bodhu, it becomes infinity so on the except on the particular value we have neglect paniru in the range la, minus pi to plus pi la, closed interval la rindu. ok so except parabola meedhi yalla adhukkume nama ondhu parameter theta adhi in the parameter use paniru so for uh, circle and ellipse theta would range lies between 0 to 2 pi and for hyperbola minus closed interval minus pi to plus pi except plus or minus pi by 2 and for t and parabola la parameter t t would range in a minus infinity to plus infinity 
So be thorough with these parametric equations. So the same conic circle equation and the ellipse. And now compare the equations of circle and ellipse a cos theta, a sin theta. And for ellipse a cos theta, b sin theta. And the value mutu differ on y coordinate la a sin theta, but here b, b sin theta. So more or less circle and ellipse one na. In an ellipse, if the length of the major and minor axis if uh, equal in length, rendu ellipse la major axis order length to minor axis order length to equal achabdina, it becomes a circle. Okay. Now let us see the condition for the line y equal to mx plus c to be a tangent to the conics. So tangent is a straight line. Already we know that tangent in the straight line now. So the equation of the y equal to mx plus c. So all straight lines so or curve tangent a particular condition satisfy under straight lines matunda and the curve tangent a irkamudio. So other than a solar that is called the condition for tangent c. So for all conics we are going to discuss the condition for tangent c. So over conic go and the condition for tangent c in y equal to mx plus c in the straight line tangent of varano of dina in the condition is satisfy panano that we are going to discuss now. So first let us see for circle the general equation of the circle is x square plus y square equal to a square. So for circle the condition for tangent c is c square is equal to a square into 1 plus m square. Okay. So in the condition for tangent c la epome in the c value and m value always taken from the straight line equation that is m represents the slope of the straight line and c represents the y intercept of the straight line and a value a, a value is taken from the circle equation which is nothing but the radius of the circle okay so in the condition first verify pananu if if this condition satisfied then we can say the straight line y equal to mx plus c is the tangent to that circle so on the straight line one the circle ku tangent abdina solirla in the condition satisfy pannudhu abdina okay tangent tangent nu soliyaachu so tangent means it should touches the curve exactly at one point isn't it so that is called the point of contact of the tangent so now to find the point of contact of the tangent the general form is point of contact the tangent order point of contact minus or plus a m by root of 1 plus m square plus or minus a by root of 1 plus m square. So to find the point of contact of the tangent you can use this form. Then let us find the equation of the tangent and the tangent order equation. Tangent is a straight line nu paathom. So y equal to mx plus c in the formula irukku. Straight line in the nala. So instead of c and the c value is taken from the condition uh, for tangent c. The condition for tangent c irukkiliya. So on the condition le the c value way eduthu substitute pannu chariya so here c square is a square into 1 plus m square appa c value edukkum bodhu plus or minus uh, sorry mx plus or minus c ku badala a into root of 1 plus m square book la vandu inda a miss a irukku you just include that y equal to mx plus or minus a into root of 1 plus m square adhaadu y equal to mx plus c in radda tangent straight line in radda nala y equal to mx plus c Instead of c, on the condition for tangent c, the c value is substitute. Here c square is so while finding c, it becomes plus or minus a into root of 1 plus m square. Okay, now for parabola, consider the parabola y square equal to 4ax. Now the condition for tangent c is c equal to a by m. So c value, c represents the y intercept and m represents the slope of the tangent or the straight line given straight line order slope and y intercept tha in the m and c a endra the parabola equation la irundhi edukkurom okay so c equal c value and the y intercept vandu a by m ku equal a irundhadu appadina the straight line is a tangent to that parabola now the point of contact is a by m square comma 2a by m now the equation of the tangent is y equal to mx plus c so instead of c in the c appadi in the c value inga here we are substituting a by m like that in the c square in the nala while finding c value plus or minus one the here c value the here so directly write the c value and for ellipse the equation is x square by a square plus y square by b square equal to 1 ellipse equation 
Now the condition for tangent C for ellipse is C square equal to A square M square plus B square. And likewise the point of contact of the tangent is minus A square M by C B square by C. Now the equation of the tangent is y equal to mx y equal to mx plus c. So c value is taken from the condition for tangent c layer clear. So here c square c value plus or minus root of a square m square plus b square. This is the equation of the tangent. So ellipse tangent of the straight line in the format y equal to mx plus or minus root of a square m square plus b square. And finally, hyperbola, in hyperbola equation x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to 1. Here the condition for tangent c is ellipse of hyperbola, just a slight changes na irukko. Likewise, ingiyo the tangent, the condition for tangent c also here plus and here minus will come. Likewise, the point of contact of the tangent la, so here x coordinate alone negative, here y coordinate, both x and y coordinates are negative. And here the equation of the tangent is y equal to mx plus or minus c value. So plus or minus root of a square m square minus b square. The same thing here instead of plus for hyperbola minus will come. So this is the condition for y equal to mx plus c the straight line. The different conics tangent of varano abdina the condition ayala adhavandu satisfy pannanu. Parabola abdina it should satisfy the condition c equal to a by m and for ellipse hyperbola and circle so and then the conic uriya and the condition for tangency is satisfy under straight lines matunna and the conic straight sorry tangent to find the equation of the tangent at x1 comma y1 to the curve we should we should do some replacements that is or curve ku, at x1 comma y1 la tangent equation kandu we should replace and the curve equation la replace x square by x x1 and y square by y y1 and replace x by x plus x1 by 2 and replace y by y plus y1 by 2 Adhada, at x1 comma y1 la tangent equation veenu obdina and the curve equation la ulla x square y square x and y ku badala these replacements we have to give. For example, consider the circle equation x square plus y square equal to a square. Now, the equation of the tangent at x1 comma y1 to this circle is give the replacements x square as x x1 plus y square as y y1 equal to a square. So, similarly for all types of uh, conics, if you want to find the equation of the tangent at x1 comma y1, just give these replacements in the equation of the curve. You will get the tangent at x1, y1. Now let us see the tangent and normal equations for all the conics. We are going to see the tangent and normal equations. So already we know that normal is a perpendicular line. Isn't it? Normal is always perpendicular to the tangent and also passes through the point of contact of the tangent. So already circle concept we discuss pannu. normal always perpendicular to the tangent and it should pass us through the point of contact of the tangent. Okay, just other Now the equation of the circle is x square plus y square equal to a square. To get the tangent equation, what I ask you to do? Replace x square by x x1 and y square by y y1 equal to a square. So, this is the equation of the tangent in Cartesian form. The parametric formula we know, Dina, circle of the parametric equation in a path of a cos theta, any point on the circle is of the form a cos theta, comma uh, a sin theta, Din Patama. So, x ka badala and the a cos theta and y ka badala, y1 ka badala uh, a sin theta. So, put x1 equal to a cos theta and y1 equal to a sin theta. So, on the a common I add to in the side a square irukha. So, after uh, cancel pannadu kapro equal to a abdi inu kadek. Chariya. So, in the Cartesian formula on the x1 y1 ku badala any point on the circle is of the form. Parametric form paakam bodhu paathto liya. So, on the point x1 y1 ku badala substitute panna kadekka kudiyadu. Parametric form of the 
tangent. So to get the Cartesian equation we should give that uh, replacements and to get the parametric form we have to replace x1 y1 by the parametric form and the point to the parametric form any point on the circle parametric form first table column la liya, so and the point ala inge replace panirno x1 nayum y1 nayum similarly for parabola y square equal to 4ax appo equation of the tangent at x1 comma y1 replace y square by y y1 and replace x by x plus x1 by 2 x plus x1 by 2 varo so inge or 4 iruka adu cancel aanadukapra it becomes 2a so y y1 equal to 2a into x plus x1 this is the equation of the tangent for parabola so that would parametric form parametric form on the two uh, at comma 2at at square comma 2at abdi in patho so x1 y1 ku badala on the point a substitute panero so it becomes yt equal to x plus at square and then the ellipse ku tangent equation cartesian equation dina x square replace x square by x x1 and y square by y y1 remaining terms being same that is all. So, while finding the parametric equation of the tangent replace x1 by a cos theta and y1 by b sin theta. So, on the b or b cancel a iro a cos theta a square irukli a cancel a you will get the parametric form as x cos theta by a plus y sin theta by b equal to 1. So, similarly for hyperbola the equation of the tangent is the same thing here will come so instead of plus here minus will come but while writing the parametric equation we should replace x1 by a secant theta and y1 by b tan theta because any point on the hyperbola is of the form a secant theta comma b tan theta first table column la path only. so other inga replace one both the parametric uh, equation of the tangent so tangent ku how to write the Cartesian equation of the tangent and parametric equation of the tangent in path. So, to get the Cartesian form of the tangent, replace x square by x x1, y square by y y1 and replace x by x plus x1 by 2 and replace y by y plus y1 by 2. These replacements you have to give. And to get the parametric form in the Cartesian formula, instead of x1, y1 ku badala, and the point any point on the curve be in first table column la path. So, on the point substitute panirno. Okay. Now, the equation of the normal, we know that normal is always perpendicular to the tangent. So, that the format is So, to get the uh, normal equation, we have to interchange the x and y coefficients and put y, uh, minus symbol before the y term. Usually, on the coordinate geometry, we will say only one straight line is perpendicular and another straight line is format. So, the very same procedure. So, in the formula, normal equation, in the formula, on the for one mark just to know this formula know this formula but without knowing this formula we can find the equation of the normal how so coordinate geometry la padichirukom illaya tangent equation kandupidichitom appadinaale automatically normal is always perpendicular to the tangent and also passes through the point of contact of the tangent so on the concept of we can easily find the normal equation so in the equation da theriyano appadindradhu avasiyam illa that is tangent equation no, no need to memorize and the replacements mattu kudutha podu given equation la and the replacements kudutale kadachirum seriya so adhiley particular normal equations no need to memorize just from the tangent equation la irundhe normal equation ah derive pannirala adoda perpendicular form ah vechu and the point of contact ah substitute pannum bodu constant kadachirum so adha vechu pannirala so for one mark kaga just to know these equations so cartesian form parametric form so similarly for all the conics the equation of the normal uh, both the Cartesian form and parametric form are given in your book. Just go through these equations for one mark part.